And now we already have a new financial product called the TLTRO, which is lovely. Um, targeted longer term refinancing operations. I haven't even really dug into this one, although you can just generally assume these things mean more money's gonna be printed. Hello there, my friends. Chris Mark is here with you for Arcadia Economics. And today, a quick video about what's been going on in Europe. This was a couple of weeks ago, but didn't get a chance to comment on this yet and think it's worthwhile uh, because you have the European Central Bank launching new stimulus and major policy reversal. Again, we have these situations where countries print money, they say, all right, we're gonna tighten, you know, it's just temporary. And then once they start to feel the pain, I mean, the European Central Bank was quick to reverse course. Uh, and as you can see, there's Mario Draghi. And we'll hold interest rates at sub-zero levels at least through December, months longer than previously signaled. And given the way the economy's going and the fact that we're seeing this pressure show up, I don't really see why that would change in December. I mean, it hasn't changed since uh, in the last couple of years. And now we already have a new financial product called the TLTRO, which is lovely. Um, targeted longer term refinancing operations. I haven't even really dug into this one, although you can just generally assume these things mean more money's gonna be printed. And then you only have to go a paragraph further. The TLTROs are loans that the ECB provides at cheap rates to bank in the Euro area. As a result, lenders are able to provide better credit conditions to customer, which in turn stimulates the real economy, just not today or this year, next year, but someday down the road, according to the bankers. Um, maybe I should or shouldn't say this, but I'll go on record as saying it's outright fraud when you really dig into the mechanics of these central banks and understand the history of these central banks and what they're doing. I don't believe, I used to, uh, although I no longer believe this idea that the Fed is our friend or the ECB is our friend and just trying to make sure we have stable pricing and maximum employment. Uh, I think it's a rather unfortunate scenario that works out well for the banks and politicians and is incredibly damaging to people who are just honest folks trying to go out and live and do their thing. So um, again, you don't have to take my word for it. Just look at the last 20 years of history and see how these interest rate cycles have played out. Welcome to message me on Arcadia Economics. There's a contact tab. I'll happy to explain anything or make a video about it if it is not clear. But again, European Central Bank going back to money printing and we'll see how this one goes. Thanks as always for watching.